This is a perfect example of how I had a 10 minute video talking about the experience that I had um, dealing on witch talk while simultaneously having godchildren and taking care of my mom. And you made me make, make it private because just by the little bit of what I said in another video and just the title of saying, you know, I had tears, you immediately go to this. Like I took my mom to domestic violence counseling. I had to go through counseling and therapy myself for two years. And then I worked on myself two years after my mom died and lived my life. But just because I show any bit of emotion that is neither, that is not happy or angry, then I have processed trauma. Do you know how many people on this app are on medication for everything from anxiety to just general functioning? And I'm not. Do you know how many people on this app have an addiction problem? whether it's um, SEX or it's um, pharmaceuticals or other types of pharmaceuticals or they can't even go one day without smoking a cigarette or a drink or a weed. So please don't come to my platform and try to diagnose me just because I went through shit in my life and I actually had to go deal with it and continue going on with it and actually have the bravery to talk about it and be a man because men aren't supposed to have emotions and they're not supposed to feel you rather we punch it out punch out the people you know to get the emotions out right no you have a red flag